Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, I'm John, this is Many a Truder, welcome back to Subnautica. Well, last time, we made it here to, I'm not entirely sure. Um, all I know is, the game said, hey, find something that's like, super far down, and has also got fossils nearby, and eventually, after much searching, I found my way to a big cave, where the game said, hey, plenty of fossils round here, so... Okay, gonna work under the assumption we're in the right place. Let's have a bit of a look-see, see what we got round here. Because one thing we've got round here is, yes, the um, remains of Snakey McGee. With a note attached saying, oh dear, looks like this was eaten by something even bigger and higher up the food chain. So, I'm looking forward to meeting that, though I suspect... I may have already done so, because yes, I made my way to a different biome last week, the, um, the crater, or something, and let's just say it didn't go well for me, but yeah, there was a big transparent lad floating around there, I think he might have been the bigger fish in question. Still, to make sure I can make my way back here, I've left a beacon at the start of this area, so that's now marked as the fossil zone, I now know how to get back here if I have to, you know, back out, and uh, how to retrace my steps if this area turns out to be a bit, you know, amazing. And for the time being, lights, oh, that doesn't really, doesn't really help much, does it? No, okay. Bring her up to normal speed, and yeah, just start moving in. Alright, just start moving in. What we should be doing is just... No, seriously, that is cocking useless. Okay, check my check my cameras here. I feel like these could be more useful. Yeah, we're going down. Which is good. I need it to be going down. Because right now I'm not deep enough. Okay, we're down to 600 odd meters. Still no major sign of trouble. Just turn around here. Because yes, I've got, I've got one thing I can use here. I know this base is southwest of Giant Gun Island, where I'm trying to get to the disease research facility. And I've got Giant Gun Island marked. So, if that's straight above me, then I need to be going... Oh, hello, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You're not what I've seen before. You're not the same as the sharks. You're like... Are these baby Snakey McGee's? Because they've got kind of like, um, four tentacles around them. They look sort of similar. If they are, I think I need to know. And that unfortunately means stepping outside and trying to scan them, which I'm going to regret, but we'll give it a cocking go. River Prowler. I'm going to be honest, it's not attacking me yet, which is... Okay, never mind. Yes, it is. 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 Keep scanning it. Keep, keep scanning it. Keep, keep scanning it. Keep... Now get back inside in a hurry. Okay, get back inside. In a hurry, please. Honestly, that was only a light nibble. I'm fine. Right, fauna, and yeah, we can write that one up as a uh, carnivore. So, bites people, yeah, unnoticed. Will attack aggressively, but okay. If I can just get round the side of it, then eel like torso, highly vulnerable. Okay, that suggests I might be able to take it out by just, you know, getting round the side of it. Giving it a bit of a stabbing. So, John, you're not currently piloting. Still, we're approaching the correct depth here. Which is marvellously good news. Though, uh, again, just cameras, eyes open for anything we've not... Oh, hello, that's... That appears to be a waterfall that's underwater. Which... That doesn't make sense, right? I don't think that makes sense, but okay, fine. Maybe it's like a gas that's heavier than water and thus would flow like that even underwater. Is that a thing? Does that make sense? I'm not sure. All right, bring her down here. Bring her down because I'm still looking for, yeah, signs of new outcrops. That's a ruby over there. But other than that, it's just quartz by the looks of it. That's... That's sandstone. That doesn't help me. Right, bring her in. Use the, yeah, the uh, keel camera. Always strikes me as uh, 
the most useful. Yet some more cocking rubies. Keep on keeping on. There's some purple plant life over there. That's another drop. Again, not seeing that again. Hang about. Not you, buddy. I think that's a generic rock. Alright, just more of them ahead. Come back out for a second. We are almost underneath Giant Gun Island. And I'm going southwest. Well, roughly. I'm going west at the moment, but we're kind of going in the right direction. So this here, this is, this is good. That's a good point. So far, I've just been dealing with what I've had aboard the, um, the ship. Am I allowed to actually build, like, things? Like, say, a basic fabricator on... I can, but it would increase the, um, the power draw. So I could have, if I wanted to, a source of fresh water on this boat, but we know that drains the power like nobody's cocking business, so maybe don't do that. Oh, hello! We got something. Uh-oh. We got one. I figured as much. If there's something down here that's eating, yeah, actual sneaky McGee's, it was going to be that bastard. Now, just in theory, is that thing so big that if I wasn't in like a massive ass submarine, it wouldn't be able to detect me? Because here we go. We have now reached the correct no, 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 no. Off you, off you, off you. Uh oh, uh oh. I kind of feel like he's 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 coming in this direction. Prepare to activate silent running mode. Just do it. I don't like him because I know for a fact he's he's killed a submarine before. He can do it, but I want to scan him. If I could learn their weakness, then maybe I'd have a chance against them. I've got to give it a go at the bare minimum. It's possible when it's just me on my own. I'm so small, they don't care. All right, buddy. No trouble. No trouble. And you guys are... Hang on. Are you different from... Yeah, you're not the same guys I've seen before, right? And just get a bit... Get a bit closer. Ghost Ray. Okay, I feel like the, the Prowlers are baby... Yeah, Snakey McGee's. I feel like you know I'm here and you don't like him. Yeah, I feel like the Prowlers are baby Snakey McGee's. And you are baby that big old bastard. Now, are you a problem? Okay, poisonous flash. So, alright, herbivore. Good. Good, good, good. So he's no trouble. Just maybe don't bump into him. Might poison you. Stick to the edge of the cave. Don't get a light out. Just get up to him. Give him a loop sing. Alright. If he attacks me, he attacks me. You know, that's that's a shame, but it happens. Let's just see if we can give him a poke. Stay away from you. Don't care about you. I feel a bit exposed right now. Maybe stay nearby to rocks. There we go. Problem is, even if he... Oh! I feel like he knows about me. He's he's a juvenile. Oh, he's only a kid. He's only a kid. Oh, he's, 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 he's nasty. He's nasty. Okay. I need to, need to heal, like, now. Now. Okay, go. And maybe if we can get around the side of his head. Okay, go, 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 come, come on, come on. Yet, it's only the head that's scannable. Got him! Go! Get back to the cocky sub now. Okay, that was... That's a baby one. The baby one to eat Snakey McGee. Okay. That's just the babies. Oh, no. Um, well, we got him scanned. We got him scanned. That's the important thing. Now, we shall learn his weak point. Okay, it's all going to be just fine. And uh, limestone, great. And, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Not that. Okay. That's poison. Whatever this heavier than water gas is, it is poisonous or acidic or something. 
Still, I shan't say no to a ruby while I'm passing by. All right, let's um, let's plan the next move here because uh, I don't see a way around. This seems to be a linear cave, just one way straight through. So if I'm going through here, I need to know where I'm going next. And no, no, no trouble. No trouble, buddy. No trouble. Just going to stay down here. There you go. Can't get to me, you stupid. I feel like he can get to me. 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 I feel like he can. Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Am I supposed to be going straight through or down? Because there's definitely a down option in this cave. But I don't know if that's where I'm supposed to be. No, John, the submarine only goes to 900. And also the world occasionally unloads. Uh, okay. I think what we need to do is okay. Let's just let's just get back to the back to the sub, back to the sub. He's definitely annoyed. He's he's definitely he's definitely he's definitely he's definitely he's definitely leave me alone. Ow, okay. I think he just messed. Okay. Um. Um. Okay. Now I've got inside the submarine. I didn't want him to attack. So that's good. Uh. Is he behind me right now? I think he might have just got behind me. Oh. Okay. He's definitely go go go. Put her into fast mode. Go. Go, go, forget everything, just he's right cocking next to me. Lights on, I can't cocking see. Uh, okay, he's he's around and he, he's, he's really not impressed with me right now. Uh, I'm just looking forward to, yeah, preacher attack and no, there's another cave over there. I should have really crafted some, oh bloody hell, the engines are overheating. Okay, that's fine, just get over here, check the radar. He seems to have chilled out. Okay, I think he was just, yeah, defending his area. He might just be territorial. Just go Okay, something's still coming up behind me. No, no, never mind. He's still, he's still about. He's still not thrilled. Uh, keep on keeping on. Check radar, he's falling back. He's falling back. There's, oh, there's a fire. There's, there's apparently a fire. And this thing doesn't have an autopilot. Uh, okay, well, this is this is a, a concern. Where's the cocking fire? Does anyone know where the, the fire is right now? Uh, ha, ha. Uh, okay, there's, there's a fire somewhere. I don't, I don't know where. If it's the engine, that's more of an issue. I'm not... I'm not seeing a... a also, John, use the... John, use the cocking ladder. Something's on cocking fire. You say fires. Ah, there it is. I see it. I see it. I'm working on it. Work in progress. Okay. Fire. It was just the lockers. I don't know how precisely they ended up. Oh, it's full of smoke now. There's there's now there's now smoke. Okay, there's now external hull damage. The radar shows no sign of trouble. Fire. Extinguished. Air scrubbers initiated. Okay, there is damage. Do I need to fix things one by one? Or can I just go outside like the uh, the sea moth? All right, how do we how do we fix this? Because I'm seeing the water come in. Yes. So hang about that. No, that was just the power cells. I'm not seeing the ability to fix individual things here. I might just need to then again, John. Maybe check the thing that was like on fire. Well, I'm not seeing trouble. All right. Nip outside for a sec. He does not seem to be pursuing. Okay. Probably shouldn't have tried to outrun him. Now, where's the... The issue? And how do I... How do I fix it? Okay, I'm going to be honest. Not 100% sure how we... How we fix this old girl. So, ah, hang on. There's something right there. Ah, you've got to actually find uh, the spot where there's a breach. So, okay. I saw there was exterior hull damage. And look for the bubbles. Bubbles are a pretty good indication something's gone cocking wrong. Dear, oh dear, my poor bloody ship. Right, fix that up. Is there any more trouble? Or are we good? I think when I'm... No, nope, there's definitely something wrong at the back there. All right. I think we're now uh, calm and safe. And with that bastard behind me. And also, more importantly, where is 
That's Giant Gun Island. I'm going southwest. We are now at the correct depth, and we're going in the right direction. Also, good point. We never actually read the entry that we risked our lives to, um, to get. Okay, so these guys are officially called Ghost Leviathans. Though, as it's a new creature we've only just scanned, I don't know, possibly I'm letting my PDA do the naming. So, alright, fine. They're Ghost Leviathans. So while they're young, they hide in caves and eat anything going. Before they get too big, they go out into the open ocean. I'm guessing into the big crater that's, uh, yeah, where I saw this guy's mum and dad. And they're even nastier. Meanwhile, check this thing. Okay, health has now been restored, though for some reason the UI is behind the river over there, but whatever. Okay, keep on keeping on. If we're lucky, that's going to be it for drama today. That could be, you know, the end of it. I'd be really happy if that could just be, you know, the end of the Ghost of Ithans and all. Oh. We've got to... Oh, hang on. I'm about to ram something. It's fine. That is an alien base. And I'm about to ram something again. It's fine. Chill out. It's all under control. So this is it. This is what we've been looking for. The entire point of the game is uh, get yourself sorted the out. appears to have collapsed to the sea floor. Okay. It might not be in good shape, though. And hang about. Would have thought so. It's the Woobly Whoopers. Okay, so uh, this thing's kind of, uh, yeah, collapsed, but it's still being guarded, I guess, by the Woobly Whoopers. Now, that's got to be the entry point right there in front of me. And to be honest, I don't really have the, uh, yeah, maneuverability to check in this submarine. Broadcast. Linguistic analysis reads, Caution, hazardous materials and life forms contained within. Alright, so, uh, bad stuff. But, we knew that. Okay, uh, turn her off. Power down, please. Just, uh, power down all systems. Uh, turn all lights off. It's fine. We'll find our way back here. This area seems to be self-lit by... Something. Bioluminescent life forms. Let's just say that. That explains everything. All right. Eyes open. Watch. Oh, bloody hell. Yep, there you cocking are. Bastards. Okay. They don't hurt that much. Let's just get over here. Ignore them. Okay, you can't ignore them. Interior walls in this section are substantially reinforced, indicating the designers were seeking either to keep something out or contain it within. Whatever their intention, it clearly failed. Okay, so this thing was supposed to be, yeah, reinforced, but something's gone wrong. It's been broken, shattered, diddly diddly d. I'm guessing they had something locked inside and it broke out. I mean, at disease research, you're going to have specimens. They just specimens the wrong thing, and we've seen just how nasty some of the specimens on this planet could get. They were trying to presumably, contain a leviathan, and it did not go well for them. Alright, just check around for any other entrances or exits, but for the most part, looks like I'm just going in the, well not front door, but like, you know, the moon pool bay or whatever. And I shan't say no to an extra bonus ruby either. Okay, now, where's Woobly Wooper? Don't know where he's got himself to, but I'm not seeing him around here. And just double check. That's limestone. Right? Because seriously, if it could not be. Yeah, it's still just limestone producing the old titanium or copper. So that there, not bloody useful. Alright, I see you over there, buddy. Let's just top up the oxygen, then head inside. Because I don't know how bad it's going to be in terms of uh, oxygen pockets. Now, admittedly, my air's as good as it's going to be, but get out there and now just get in and... Alright, where's Woobly Wooper? Doesn't seem to be... He's not chasing me today. Good. Don't want to get in a fight with him. Now, I've already got a cube with me. 
But I'll take another one. Because, yeah, those are like batteries. They power other systems. So I'm guessing... Tablet! I brought a tablet. This here is why we bring the tablets. Alright, there was a tablet previously. Good. Good, good, good. So hang on. How's my tablet supply right now? I've got one orange and two... Yeah, uh... Green cubes. So alright. Data. Now this, this has got to be what we need. So yes, as I was just speculating, this place was holding various specimens and they were testing them for vulnerability or immunity to the, what was it, the Kara. So, okay, say the Peepa. No immunity, they die within four days, but exposure to enzyme 42. Okay, Leviathan embryos. Okay, now there was your mistake. And uh, Leviathan species assigned designator C. Emperor. Bone samples from Emperor specimen indicate some potential for immunity. Single specimen captured for study a purpose built containment facility constructed in volcanic region. Okay, now we know the location or like rough location of uh, a thermal plant. Logically, they would be potentially nearby to each other. Like, that makes sense, right? Now, is there anything else here at all? Or was this literally just get in, get that information, get back out again? Because, uh, aha, this is actually one of the uh, the tanks. Okay, there might be a bit more, but I need to top up the old oxygen first. Right, back in here with a full tank. Dive under and, uh, okay, this will be, oh, specimens. Now, what sort of egg... Is this precisely? Alright, sea dragon egg. So, large egg held in a sealed environment, chemically sterilised. Without the means at the facility to house a fully grown sea dragon specimen, possible the aliens sought to study instead the egg laying and incubation process. Okay, well they said in the notes that, yeah, one of them might have been immune. So, okay, makes sense they'd be interested in these bastards. And hang about, just keep scanning. And then, yeah, we've seen the rays. Uh, they're outside. You know what? We might want to just uh, give these guys a read uh, later. Let's just get the information first. Get out and oh, bloody hell. Okay, there's a lot more than I was expecting here, actually. Still, more data. Damage report. So this will be the moment it all went a bit wrong. Leviathan detected at the perimeter, closing at high speed. Oh, they didn't try and contain a leviathan. They stole its eggs. Okay, we're dealing with that old chestnut. They stole a leviathan's eggs. Uh, the leviathans were just a little bit better at trying to hunt them down and get them back than they were anticipating. Most specimens destroyed, uh, one unaccounted for. That's the moment the quarantine uh, was imposed. Right, deeper into the museum... Can we get over to this old bastard? Yes, we can. Now, you, buddy. You're interesting. Massive remains. So, give you a scam. So, alright. What are you precisely? Vast predator. Not that vast. I've seen much bigger. Ah, a much larger ancestor to the biters and sand sharks. Okay, gotcha. But they got smaller over time, which happened in, you know, our world in evolution as well. There used to be a time when bigger was better in terms of predators, but eventually, yes, bigger wasn't better anymore, and eventually things got a bit smaller. So, yeah, things used to be a whole lot bigger at some point in history. Can I go inside your mouth, by the way? I can! Marvellous! Though I'm not sure there's any real point. I just kind of felt like doing it. All right, round we go to the next bit of the museum tour. Oh, bloody hell. Um, Warper. Oh, yeah, exactly what I suspected. These guys weren't just modified. They're also, yeah, a bit robotic, etc. So they did have a real ancestor, but they were repurposed into being sea cops. Enforcing the quarantine. And then we've just got various bits of uh, matter. Warper, warper parts. Yeah, they were being literally uh, constructed. I see. 
I see, I see, I see. Hang about, just Detecting grab the data. To the bacterium is being downloaded. Caution. Detecting atypical fluctuations in blood plasma proteins. A self-scan is strongly advised. Okay, I'll do that in a second. I might be about to run out of oxygen. So I'll get to that in just a sec. You know, it would have been appreciated to put, you know, a handful of, uh, I don't know, say, uh, brain fungus or whatever in there just so you've got a source of oxygen in the museum while you're reading. That would have been nice. Now, are we done with the museum? Yeah, this was literally where they were constructing these bastards. Just a variety of uh, hearts of the woobly whoopers. And that seems to be your lot in, uh, in here. So that's the final date dump. That's just the end of the same room. No, that seems to be your lot. So in which case, I'm guessing this is uh, bad news. Self-scan complete. Bacterial infection has spread to the skin and pulmonary system. Medical report recorded to date to bank. It is imperative you find a way to neutralize the infection. Okay, decided to take my gloves off at 800 meters down. That was a ballsy decision right there. But okay, I've got a lead. All right, enzyme, what was it? 42, apparently could do the job. And one kind of leviathan makes it. I just need to find that leviathan, which seems to just be a case of locating, well, hang on. If it wasn't in the disease research facility, where was it? Okay, the report's got a couple of leads for me. One, find more alien bases. Two, figure out how the locals dealt with it. If there's a way local creatures adapt to it, I could maybe utilize that. Though I'm not sure how I'd do that precisely. I mean, we also know basically nothing locally is resistant. Like, a couple of leviathans maybe, but not sure how that helps. So, the Kara is much bigger than we thought. It wasn't just something on this planet. It was something that had killed 143 billion people everywhere. They brought it to this world to test it on various, you know, locals. See if they could find something, anything, anywhere that might be able to have a resistance to it. But here... It went wrong, broke containment, and as a result, they've infected another entire cocking world. Okay, so, where next? Because, uh, kind of, but notice, there's, yeah, more than one way to go. There's uh, the way we came in, then there is what looks like a couple of different ways out. Now, I'm not underneath John Base 1 yet. But this has been a long way to go. This cave system might go in a hangabout. Is that, is that another one over there? There might be another exit over there. I'm not 100% sure. Okay. If we were to go, that's... No, I think that's a dead end. Okay. Let's work under the assumption there might be more places this leads. Either... It leads me to the next area I want to go to. Or alternatively, it leads me... I'm kind of just being booped by one of you bastards right now. Or alternatively, it leads me to another exit. Either is kind of fine in a way. Because, yeah, if I get a lead to take me to the next area, that's fine too. So, okay, let's... Let's go towards John Base 1. See if maybe... That can bring me to an exit that's a bit more convenient than the one I've already been using. Because that's a kilometre and a half in that direction. And it was already a bloody long way from my base. So if I could find another way in or out, that'd be great. Right, lights on. Let's see what we got, buddy. Because, yeah, it looks to me like we just want to go over to normal engine. Maybe go into slow and presumably energy efficient mode. Because power's getting a bit on the low side. And uh, honestly, I can't go that fast here 
anyway. It's a massive cocky cave. Sometimes there are bits of rock in the way. So, all right, just head over in this direction. We'll see you this. I just hit something. Don't know what it was. It was something, though. All right, lights on. Bring her up. Let's see what we got. So, this appears to be, like, pretty much straight on from where I was, I guess. Though, hang about. There's... Then we're going... Okay, then we're turning right, which isn't really where I wanted to go, but all right. Okay, when I say this looked like a way out of the cave, I think it might actually have just been a U-turn, bringing me straight back in to the exact same... Yes, yes it was. Well done, May. Okay, this looks a bit better. There's clearly something going on... Yeah, that's where I came in, because... No, hang on. No, it isn't. That's that's the way I came. That's the way I came. So that's that's not what we want. I'm looking for any other way out if one exists. Okay, here we go. And we've also got those little markers, though. Seriously, the UI is... The UI is weird in how it uh, operates with stuff that's supposed to be behind it, especially the gas. So, all right, just slow and careful. This is quite a difficult uh, area to navigate with uh, this old bastard, but I think we're just about getting... Okay, yes, yes, I know I'm about to, to ram it. It's fine. It's all under control. All right, check the surrounding area. What do we... Oh, bloody hell. Right, no, no, okay, slightly ramming, but... No, seriously, game. The waterfall should not be ahead of the... Oh, blimey. It's fine. It's definitely fine. That there is not just slightly... Slightly... Am I going... Okay, go to the cameras. Am I too high or too low right now? I don't know. I can't tell. All right, I'm stepping out here for a sec because it looks like it's all pretty chill in this part of the world and that there might be something new. This is the first time I've seen something growing out of this weird poison gas which I haven't been able to ID. I know you guys are herbivores over there, the uh, transparent lads, so alright. It's another one of these. You're definitely... I'm pretty sure he's dead. Like, it does say right there, remains. It's all right. Give you a sea dragon. Okay, you might be... Oh, they're too hot, too hot, too hot, too hot, too hot. Got too close to the thing that's hot. Okay, that's fine. Swim away. Swim away. Lovely. Right, we'll check that in a second. Sea dragons were mentioned in those notes, weren't they? Was sea dragon the one I'm looking for? Like the one that might have been immune? Oh, and hello. We've got ourselves... Okay, I will get out of the being on fire in a second. Uranites. I'm guessing that's like powerful. John, nuclear reactor. You know how to make one of them. Okay. There are things here. New things. Things we haven't seen before. Check the stones. All right. We have got like sort of but not really... Uranium, that's just basic. That's just quartz, just, you know, lit up in green. But yeah, we've got one path going up there by the Luxy of it. Is that the... Seriously, just keep your distance from all of that nonsense. Doesn't really hurt that much, but you know, never can be too careful. Then we have got... Okay, there's something... Oh, oh, bloody hell, bloody hell, bloody hell. No, 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 no trouble. No trouble, mate. No trouble, mate. No, I don't have my knife at the moment. Okay, maybe just get get the thing and go. Just go, 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 go. Bloody hell, hopefully it won't pursue, right? It's gonna be fine. Got a bit too close to... Okay, there's nothing over there. There's yet cocking more over here. All right, and I've upset someone else too. So, oh, blimey. There's something wibbly. Over there. That's a big ass tree or something. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna go top up my oxygen. Then I'm gonna go give that a Luxy. But it looks like there's multiple ways we can go at this point. Okay, I need to hurry this up because I'm actually out of water. Then there's this path, which leads to massive ass tree and also different color 
things. So I don't really know where we're going here, but it's very pretty. I'm scanning whatever the hell this is, because they seem to be, uh, this many of them in one place. Suggest they might not be keen on me being around here. Hang about. Giant Cove Tree. All right. Scanner. All right. Vast tree and a deep cove. Only one of its kind on the planet. And the rays are... Okay, they're just eating it. And, uh, hang about, maturing eggs. Ghost Leviathan. Ghost Leviathan bad. Ghost Leviathan egg very bad. But, on the other hand, Ghost Leviathan egg... You know, well, some Leviathans were slightly immune. Can I uh, help myself to a sample of this? I can't. Okay. I believe these must be the eggs. And can I do anything? No, not a thing. I was kind of hoping to take a sample. The game did just say, Hey, you might want to be paying attention to creatures that have got natural immunity. Well, Leviathans can do. But unfortunately, it seems like today, that's not going to fly. Okay. Remember that's there. At the big kind of like crossroads under the ocean but for the time being yeah i brought plenty of water but i'm kind of out of that now we need to just get going so pick a direction and go i need to get out because okay hang on if i can't get out then where do i get water from i don't cocking know all right, we're going this way, because this way is, one, towards John Base 1, and two, it's the closest. All right, no more time for sightseeing. Let's get the flip out of Dodge. Seriously, I thought I had brought plenty of cocking stuff with me in terms of, you know, uh, water, but apparently, apparently not. Okay, let's just head in this direction. We're now heading at John Base 1. Okay, I just need uh, to find my way to... Oh, the radio. It's been a while since anyone's wanted to speak to me on the radio. Then again, sometimes I get sinister messages on the radio. Spyam contains unusually high concentrations of organic and fossilized remains. Okay, so I'm back into the fossil zone, which is distinct from the zone with... Oh, hang about. That's... That's much bigger. That's a lot bigger. Okay, so... That's a cocking rib cage. Um... Oh, oh, oh. oh boy. Uh, right. Well, this is fascinating, isn't it? Yes, yes it is. Uh, okay, I know I just said no more diversions, but I'm going to be honest, I'm going to be a little bit diverted for a sec here. Did I by any chance have anything with water in it? Oh, that's rotten! But it will grow if planted anyway. Okay. Do I have anything else with me? No, I've got 10 million cocking. Should have brought more water. Really should have done. Okay. We have got a cocking massive thing here. Really want to give this thing a scam. Because this is... This is bigger than anything I've seen. This is bigger than the ghost leviathan anything and oh speak of the devil there's one up there okay we just need to skirt around him give these guys a bit of distance and uh, ghost leviathan's freaking out a bit hello over there i'm giving this a scan don't you dare tell me i can't scan this because this is too awesome to not scan all right you are kind of going for me Go, gargantuan fossil. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. Okay, just get the... John, use the thing that speeds things up. Seriously, we're in a cocking hurry. Okay, maybe just skirt around the outside of the room and just get going as fast as possible. All right, seriously, water's down to almost 25% and I'm now out of additional water. Let's... We've got to go. But that was pretty badass, that ridiculous skeleton. Okay, I think I saw it over on that side. So we're just going to go around the outskirts of this room. And try and look for a way. Yeah, there you are. He's all the way over there. Was that him? Was that one of the smaller ones? I don't 
no one's thing about. There's John, seriously, you've you've got to stop doing this, but that is No, that's just a bit of light on a thing, it's fine. Just get down over here. Sneak under this. Keep your eyes open. That looks like path over there. Alright, we're just going to avoid this. Power's okay. I'm more worried about water right now. Where is he? He's over. Uh-oh. Where are you? Where are you going? Off you go. Back in the other... No. 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 Silent running. Hold. Still. Till he goes. Maybe. Okay. Get out. Go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I know we might be about to nudge something. It's fine. I'm okay with that. That's fine. Let's just get through here. And where is... We're now actually approaching the islands. I wish I knew where we were going, by the way. But I don't. We're just we're just sort of going. Also, John! It might be time to put the sub into not first gear. We're actually in a cocking hurry. Because you're going to die from... Yep, there we go. Seat fluid intake. Morning. Vessel cavitating. Excessive noise. Okay, maybe not excessive noise. Excessive noise might be not, not the right option. Where the cock am I now? Uh, okay, hang about. I, I can't cocking say it does not help. That visibility here seems to be quite poor. Uh, there's another one of their massive ass skulls dotted about over here. Do I want to scan you by the... Oh, hang on. Hang on. We've got something... We've got something going on over here. We have got... Okay. It's, it's fine. It's fine. I know I said I shouldn't get distracted, but there's clearly something going on here. And the game did specifically say, hey, make sure you, like, you know, check what's going on. Ancient Skellington. Give you a scan. All right. Because this is close by to the location. Ancient Fossilized Skellington. All right. They were actively studying this thing. Okay. Yes. What does that, what does that mean, though? What's the, oh, alien sensor. Okay, this has got to be important. They were literally studying these things. Uh, hello over there. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Rubies. And uh, we've got ourselves uh, a thing. That's just a light. And then, oh, you want orange. Okay, I've got one of them. Uh, so slap you in there. Right. And uh, we have got ourselves a... Oh, my. This old cock can do the job. Uh, this is what I needed. They said search more data. Okay, I will read all of this later. Okay, right now we just need to scan and go. Alien flora specimen. All right, scan that. I've seen you bastards. A uh, uh, couple of cubes. Well, I say couple. John, there's blatantly three. You can tell because they're all standing next to each other. On, like, you know, podiums and stuff. So, uh, may as well grab them on the way past. There must be some data here. They were studying this thing for some reason, right? This might just be the front room. And finally, alien research equipment. And... Uh, oh my goodness, it's... It's a really cute little egg thing. Okay, well, we'll have all of that. Gonna get over anywhere else? No. Is that your lot. Anything else that needs? I need to go. John, the data. Do not forget the data. Alright, reproductive data and some form of kelp. I need to cocky go. Get back to the sub. Let's get up. So I don't know what happens if I run out of water, but I feel like it's going to be bad. And right now I have no way of generating more. Here we go through the cave, which had this in. We're now into... Oh, bloody hell. We're into a different cocky biome now. Uh, we're into... Oh, I'm I'm actively... I think I'm actively losing health on encounter, but this looks good. This is... Okay, we're, we're ascending. We're ascending right now. I'm actively dying. How fast am I? Oh, no. This is, this is going to be embarrassing. Uh, uh... Uh, okay, just this is everything's fine aside from the fact I need water 
now and I have no cocky way of... Why am I not rising? Continue just desperately. I'm about to die from lack of water. Okay, I might be about to die, but I think I have found a way sort of up. Where the cock am I? Engine's overheating, is it? I, I kind of... It's not my biggest priority right now. Not my biggest priority. Just trying to get back to the engine temperature. Okay, we'll put you back to, to normal. And now we're up to reef backs. Okay, hang on. Where, where the flip am I? Where even am I? Giant Gun Island's two kilometers in that direction. John Base 1 is... Hang on, where's the island? If John Base 1's a kilometer, I was going towards... A, the island. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Where, where is it? I'm... I died from lack of water. In the cocking ocean game. Except, hang on. Now I'm... Wait. Where am I now? Am I... Oh. If you die, you just... I was kind of assuming I was going to be restarted to... Do I still have all the data I got? I appear to do so. Okay, hang about. Where the cock am I? Because I don't actually have a beacon anymore. I marked one thing and oh. Article bio matches seven of the nine preconditions for stimulating terror in humans. Okay, um, wherever I am, apparently it's a bad thing. Okay, hang on, go up to the surface and try and figure out where the cock I am precisely. Um, because I don't, I don't know. I just need to get up to the surface. I'll feel better once I'm up there. And then we can look around and try and identify... Where the flip am I? Uh, okay. Turn her around. Because apparently wherever I am, there is an entrance to the cave system. The problem I've got here is... Okay, what's my nearest marker? And that is Island. So, located... Hang on, what direction is that? So, southeast of the island. The island that's located to... No, John. If you're facing southeast. And that means it is, you know, northwest. So, northwest of the island. Okay. We should be able to triangulate this. Meanwhile, if I go... Detecting due... multiple Leviathan class life forms in the region. Are you certain whatever you're doing is worth it? No, on the contrary, I've just decided not to be here. Okay. I want to go, or rather I need to go, approximately 900 meters to the east. Okay, in order to get to John Base 1. Okay, so if I... Right, you know what? We can do this. That's actually not that far. That's relatively convenient. Turn her around. It's time to cock and go. Because apparently this is, this is bad space. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We are going to, right now, just it over to, hang about, that's, is that, is that an island over there that I don't know about? Because there's, well, there's something going on over there. Hang on, giant gun. Or is that the Aurora? That might be the Aurora, just really, really cocking far away. But let's, let's just get out of here. We're going pretty much east. So therefore, if I was going 900 meters east, if I was to go 900 meters, yeah, that's just the Aurora. If I was to go 900 meters west, then I would rediscover that location that I was just in. And that would give me a much closer way to access that cave network. But okay, I would say, ladies and gentlemen, we have made it through the cave system. We have returned to the surface. That's enough for now, and I need a bloody cup of tea. So... Okay, let's go home, let's take stock, and let's figure out what my next move is. Because I suspect, and I say this with a heavy heart, we're going straight back down there. Because, yeah, there was a whole bunch of stuff we weren't able to explore. So hopefully you join me for more Utter Cave Terror next time, ladies and gentlemen. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nerd. And this has been Subnautica. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Jebediah Kerman has not exploded. Oh shit. Why did that happen? Five, four, three. Oh, I forgot to turn the thrust on. Five, four. Is everything else? How is everything? Up.
to that point, that was going better than anyone expected. 